In the floor is lava news. <gasps> oh my god, for reals? I put my feet up. Me too. Submitted by John John Loves Food. I love food too. Hawaii's Big Island Volcano has already destroyed a huge part of the island, and scientists don't know when it will stop. Oh shit. Sounds like On a the big island? To me. No. Big island. Is Where is it? that? Wow. Yeah. Down. Oh. It's still, the, the volcano is still active, so. It's been active for 30, 30 years. Yeah. How do you kill time when that's going on? You know, like what do you... Like when lava's just coming out? Or you can't be scared the whole time, you know? Like do you... You evacuate. Play cards? But what do you do once you've evacuated to somewhere safe, you know? Oh. How do you, you know, pass the time? Mm. Arm wrestle? You just get stabbed. Arm wrestle's short though. That's true. Yeah, how do you pa play cards? Yeah. Probably do the same shit because Hawaii is just like an island, so... They're probably doing the same exact stuff like on the other side of the island. Chilling. Yeah. <laughs> Maybe arm wrestling actually is good. You could have like a huge tournament. Yeah, see who's the best in that uh, evacuation zone. Yeah. yeah. They actually have that. Really? Evac zone? No. Evac zone champs? Yeah. <laughs> no, like uh, arm wrestling tournaments. Oh, yeah. Like the one with Sylvester Stallone? Our powerlifting meets, yeah. They have like a whole setup and everything with pads and like a ref, all that. And Did you guys like... watch that movie back in the day? Yeah. That shit was fucking tight, dude. Yeah. What is it? I gotta watch it. What is it called? I arm wrestle Stallone. Oh. <laughs> I don't know, but it was one with him and then like, whoever push won. Push me to the limits, push it to the limits. Yeah, like whoever that. won run like won this dope ass fucking like semi truck that would help him with his business. <gasps> oh, I remember that. Yeah. yeah. Wow, was it good? Uh, from as it's a child. Sylvester no. Stallone. Yeah, they were all truckers. In the 90s. Yeah. Yeah. And he's all jacked. There was a lot of stuff that I thought was good. As and he had that fat friend, friend that was like big. But he looked the same, so it was around the same time as Rambo, so I just mm -hmm. thought it was Rambo who just drove oh, trucks. Oh, like Rambo. You thought it was like Rambo 5 yeah, or something? Yeah, because I was so young, I didn't know. Like he didn't re-enlist and he was like just out working. <laughs> it did always seem like that with Stallone. It always seemed like he was just kind of like... Rambo. Oh, what's, yeah, he's Rambo, now he's driving a truck, now he's boxing. Yeah. It's just the same guy in all the... Yeah, that's It's true. weird because a lot of the characters that he played, they were idiots. You know what I mean? They're very like dumbed down, stupid people. Yeah. So for the longest time, I thought his Rocky accent was how he spoke. Mm. And so like, you know, when we got he older... He doesn't? He's, he's, he's... It's not super much different. I didn't know they were... I didn't know they were idiots. It's pretty, no, if you, if you listen to he's all like that. In, in Rocky, like, oh. he's, a, he's a fucking moron. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, he's a loser on Rocky, but, oh. no, but I was a child, so yeah. you don't know, like. No, that's what I'm saying. Because your IQ's, yeah. like, low oh, as a child. Oh, you mean, like, his IQ, that's how he really talked. No, yeah. in the, if you listen, if you, when's the last time you saw Rocky? Uh, like. It's been a while, right? Like, yeah, well, Rocky, if you look at Rocky in every single movie, he talks more and more like an idiot because of all those head trauma stuff. Yeah. So when he first talked, he's like, you know, Adrian, like, I just want to take you out to dinner, you know what I'm saying? And then all of a sudden later on, he just. Uh, uh, <laughs> like, it's just like, what the fuck? Yeah, he's just guessing that? vowels. Yeah, he's just making noises at that point. But then I assume that that's how he spoke as normally, but he doesn't talk like that normally. Oh, then I didn't pay attention. Yeah. So if you watch him, oh, so that was his role. Yeah. So if you oh, watch him in Tango shit. and Cash, he just speaks normally. Oh wow, because he got help. No, <laughs> that was a character he was playing. Oh. So like, I assume that's how he spoke as a normal person, but it wasn't. It was his character in Rocky. I feel like that's how he spoke. No, he has like yeah, a little. Even Rambo, he was still speaking the same way. Yeah. I think it was, man. I think he had all. Somebody said he had autism. No, he had uh, a seizure or some shit. So that's why his like lips. Are, L -l 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 -l. Oh, really? Didn't yeah. he that? Yeah. Didn't he have balls palsy some or some balls, shit? Balls, where half of his face was palsy or whatever, no? like that yeah, seizure. Bell. Like, yeah. yeah. Bell's yeah. palsy. <laughs> Bell's <laughs> palsy. Or balls. Shit. No, no, it's not balls. But how he speaks in Rocky and how he speaks in person oh, is different. Bells. It's completely different. Yeah, balls palsy. Yeah, balls. Balls. I like that one. Where half of your face becomes a scrotum. Balls palsy. Balls palsy. Where he comes and it just ball just contracts and stays there like that and just so it is. That's fucking tough. Dude, my friend, uh, you remember the ShamWow guy who did the solo yeah. ShamWows? Yeah. Oh. He has Bell's palsy. He passed away, right? Oh, no, 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 no. No, that was the, the was other dude. The oh, Oxy, Shazam. Oxy, oh, what's Oxyclean? Oxyclean. Yeah, Oxyclean. <laughs> Oxycontins, I think, because that's what killed him, I think. Is that Ron Popeil guy still alive? Who's that? Well, anyway, and we're talking about the Hawaiian volcano. Oh, Let me yeah. tell you guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right, so. It's a volcano, end of story. <laughs> no, so. There's a video. You don't want to see a video? Yeah, oh, I want to see a video. It's fucking yeah, crazy. David, I see the video. I yeah, I was, I was like watching this shit every day. I was like, this is. This is nature. Wow. So the. That's scary. So the volcano. That shit was swallowing cars and shit. Really? Oh, my God. It's I like a movie. This. Yes, I'm going to show And it'll just eat a car, huh? Mm hmm. Slowly. No. So it's already it's already Jesus. consumed 35 structures from the oh last that I saw, it's and it much. has covered an equivalent of more than 75 football fields. Fields. Damn, that'll suck if like your house was the oh one that's hip and everyone God. else is fine. Yeah. No, there's a lot of homes. Like 26 oh homes, 35 God. structures. 
Here we go. Wow! Get out of there, you crazy! So close? That's fucking lava, dude! That's Get the close. fuck out of I'm there! I'm sure they feel the heat. Oh, yeah. Look at that. It's eating that car, man. Oh, my. Is it R2-D2? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> that shit eats the Holy fence. Holy shit. What? That shit opens and breaks and entering, man. You know what? To be honest with you, I thought the fence, the fence was going to win. I thought I was gonna stop it. Dude, get the fuck yeah. out of there. These guys yeah, are crazy. Biblical, man. Yeah. That shit's like across the street from a car, and I'm thinking, why doesn't anyone just run in there, turn on the key, and drive it off? And there's just people standing around it, and it slowly fucking consumes it. You know what the cool thing is, though? Volcanic ash, high nutrition, nu nu nutrients. Yeah. A lot of plants after. Oh, yeah. really? Yep. Yeah, and they'll use some of that charcoal. They'll use it in like all kinds of facial scrubs yeah. and, yeah. um,. Hey, even ice cream you can make, you can put it in ice cream. Yeah, I'm the one that uh, started that shit, so. Really? Yeah, no joke. Really? Yeah. He owns an ice cream shop. Yeah. In Westwood? No, motherfuckers. Oh, they're the ones that copied? No, there's a lot of people that copy my oh, shit, but then I'm the one in Cape Town. If you want to try the original spot, yeah. that's my place. Wow, I'll go there. What's it called? It's called Drips and Swirls. Drips and Swirls? It sounds like a escort service. It could be. Oh. Yeah. It absolutely could be, but it's just. Well, a lot of escorts have um, post nasal drip. <clears throat> oh, from the cocaine? cocaine? <laughs> yeah. Oh, I thought it was STD. You guys know that at the same time. Because <gasps> a lot uh, of people on coke have post nasal drip. <laughs> That's true, huh? Yeah. Does that I mean some... like you always have it, like forever? I know some YouTube singers that have that shit. Really? YouTube yeah. singers? Mm -hmm. You think they're friendly in Disney, yeah. but they're cocaine addicts. The most Disneyest motherfuckers are usually the most craziest. Yeah. That's the dark arts, bro. Mm -hmm. People get caught up, dude, on that dust, son. Yup. <laughs> <laughs> I've been on it, man. That shit'll get you, dude. I know, I Lines saw your, that one stand-up when you were talking about, like, the powder and everything. That shit was so funny. <laughs> on drugs. That was funny. Was, you guys should check it out. It was really, really we have, funny. We have a friend that uh, that did a bump accidentally. Because this fool. Accidentally. Accidentally, dude. Like a stepdad. Because what happened was he went, he went to a, he went to a club and this girl came up to him, and he's like a super clean, he doesn't know shit, right? <laughs> so she's just dancing, but she thinks he's cute. She's like, you want to bump? And he thought that meant to dance. <laughs> <laughs> and she said, come closer, he thought she was coming for a kiss, and she gave him a bump. And what's a, what's a bump, what's a bump? Catch just a little bit of cocaine. Yeah. <gasps> little story. And then he was like, what was that? He goes, she goes I, gave, I just gave you a bump. He starts freaking out. No. He runs into the bathroom, he goes, oh my god, I'm gonna die. <laughs> How do you give it to like mouth to mouth? No, she just it was snorted. she just snorted it, gave oh. it on his thumb. And he was like, what the fuck was that? <laughs> I just gave you a bump. She wouldn't explain it to him because she thought that he knew. He knew, yeah. But she was already high, so she doesn't know what the fuck's going on either. But he started freaking out. He didn't know what the hell was going on with him. Yeah, people are just freaks. Mm, yeah. It's so super funny. popular. Like, cocaine's super hot right now. Like, yeah. Right now, again? That's really? It's just kidding. Kidding. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's always been hot, I think. No, but I'm talking about like... It's back, huh? It's like, it's like weed now. You know do I mean? Asian people do cocaine or not? Asian people do everything, dude. <laughs> Asian people love drugs. Yeah. Really? The ones oh my know, god, dude. dude. The ones that You're I know. You're blowing his mind. Man. I didn't know anything, man. Do you remember Harold and Kumar? Yeah. Do you remember that scene where like all the Asian kids are fucking really studious and then at the after party, they're, crazy. they're going oh, yeah, fucking they're nuts? That's, what it that's is. real life. Wow. <laughs> yeah, they're probably the number one consumers of Adderall, that's for sure. Oh, yeah. really? Yeah, the yeah. study. But is that like, uh, I thought Asian people were, were all, were naturally just, you Hi. know, <laughs> no, just knew what was going on, you know, with the, you know, classwork. Yeah, I think there's that, but I also... Is there a new breed that are all doing Adderall? No, it's always been like that. <laughs> I think... You thought they were all magical and shit? Like, they were I just mean, born <laughs> fucking knowing everything? I mean, I thought that they, yeah, they got more knowledge in <laughs> Do you sound like the fucking, like, the 1960s white guy? Like, <laughs> you know, like, back in the day, they would just see one Asian person, like, don't fuck with him, he knows kung fu. <laughs> <laughs> you know I mean? That's Leo! Like, we don't know shit. <laughs> this guy knows school. It could be, yeah, bro. These guys yeah, know bro. school, yeah, goddammit. Yeah, yeah. This no, guy's been all pro No, I grew up thinking that they could all levitate. Yeah. I thought that that was an Asian power. That's even worse. You thought we were wizards? That's kind of cool. I wish. Tim, that's just stupid. I, <laughs> I mean, I was like seven. So what's funny is that levitation was yeah. even real in your mind, too. At seven years old. No, because I, I would like watching David Blaine and that fool would always love yeah. it. So I'm like, oh my god, No, David Blaine's real. white. Yeah. No? I think he's, he's white, white, I think. Oh, is he? He looks know. black or Middle Eastern. He might be Middle Eastern, he might be Jewish, he might be Israeli. He might be... <laughs> you know what? <laughs> he might be everything. He's <laughs> those tired eyes, makes him look Asian, dude. He's just gonna like... He's tired he's been up for 77 hours, dude. It's a <laughs> stunt. He has those Mediterranean dark circles. Yeah. I like how his magic trick is insomnia. Yeah, <laughs> he's just like... <laughs> I'm like, what the fuck, bro? Pocus. Go to sleep. Pocus. <laughs> yeah. 
I'll have Sunshine. another call. Ah, his dad is half per Puerto Rican and Italian. His oh. mom was Russian Jewish. Oh, he's everything. He's all of the things that we need. Yeah, he's everything. You guys are all right. <laughs> part of the dark arts. Yeah, that's the dark arts, dude. Yeah. They, I remember the first time they had a rumor that they had an Asian kid uh, near us, right? We'd never seen an Asian kid. <laughs> And this is You're what I was crazy. like. That's yeah. dumb. Oh, ru uh, the town rumor. <laughs> oh, dude, yeah. So it spread from town to town. Hey, there's finally a Chinaman. <laughs> well, we saved up money. Me and two of my buddies saved up money to go oh, see one. Yeah. That's awesome. Yeah, what was it? It was a it was a crawfish boil place. No, it was a, um. You know what it was? It was a uh, Pizza Hut. Somebody had. <laughs> Like the roof, somebody hit a pizza hut with a truck or something, and the the roof on it had fallen off. And the Asian person was the one that hit the pizza. I'm not sure. That's because they can't drive for shit. But anyway, that's where the rumor started. Somebody's like, "Oh, there's some Asian people live in Slide L," and so we went there and checked it out, and it was just a rumors. But we saw it a nice time. It was just a really tight white person. <laughs> you didn't see Asian. We didn't see any Asian people. Oh. When yeah, when did you come right. to LA? Uh, in um 2002. Were you like mind blown? years ago. Like what? Uh, or you already been around? I'd already gotten around a little bit. I see. So, but yeah, growing up we just didn't have a lot of diversity, you know. We just had like black and white. <laughs> we that can was tell. It. <laughs> so yeah, when we got, you know, when we, people were fired about that Asian kid, um, that didn't happen, you know. So that was kind of a letdown after that. But then <laughs> they had a Mexican kid that came to our school in eighth grade, and everybody was just fucking lost their mind. <laughs> You know what's so Because he had a mustache. A Yo, we always talk about this. Because he had a shit. mustache. People have never seen a kid with a mustache. That's, That's so true. Cool. All my Mexican friends in elementary school was already starting to grow <laughs> hair and shit. I was like, what? They already had wives and shit. I know. <laughs> they had wives, bro. Yeah. He had a job. He had a job yeah. at night, like a full time job. <laughs> what do you want to do after school? I got to fucking work. Yeah. Hey, but you should come over sometimes later and meet my kids. <laughs> it's like, you're eight. <laughs>